In the 2021 Cardiovascular Disease Prevention Guidelines, we have updated the 2016 Prevention Guideline and come up with some new ways of risk prediction, uh, risk algorithms and a stepwise approach. We really want to make a guideline for primary care, for hospital care, uh, so a single guideline for, for all uh, healthcare uh, professionals. Uh, and we want to have the more individualized treatment recommendations um, for best treatment of individual patients. And for that we use a new scoring system. It's called the SCORE2 and SCORE2OP risk algorithm uh, that is recalibrated to several geographic regions in Europe. Uh, and it is uh, predicting fatal and non-fatal cardiovascular disease. And that's the starting point for the stepped approach um, for risk factor treatment. It's step one, and then for step two, it's a more intensified uh, cardiovascular risk, um, risk factor treatment uh, step. We have recommendations on older people above the age of 70 years old, because that's a majority of people we see in our practices. And we have specific recommendations on, on the global scale on air pollution uh, to reduce air pollution because that's a cardiovascular risk factor. So these guidelines are now ready for implementation in clinical practice.